If you have to wipe your nose, don't wipe it near this guy. I'm also very much of a germaphobe. And if you cough during an interview... But at some point, I hope they get it, because it's, it's a fantastic financial statement. Prepare to be thrown out like a used Kleenex. And uh, let's do that over. He's coughing in the middle of my answer. Yeah, OK. I don't like that, you know? Like my, your chief of staff. If you're going to cough, please yeah, leave the room. Not some intern, but acting chief of staff, Mick Mulvaney. On the bright side, Kim Jong-un would have had him killed. A former campaign staffer told the Washington Post it's something they're warned not to do. Well, thou shalt not cough. Imagine how Hillary would fare. <coughs> Can I get some lozenge or something? <coughs> I'll be right. <coughs> Every time I think about Trump, I get allergic. A lot of people kept <coughs> coughing up the coughing conspiracy theory. That Mulvaney was trying to signal Trump to shut up about his financial statements. This is my theory. Right. I think he was going, <coughs> don't talk about how you're broke. <coughs> Anthony Scaramucci tells of the time he had a sore throat while meeting with President Trump aboard Air Force One. The president banished him to the sick bay for a shot. There I am traveling on the most famous plane in the world. My pants are down and I'm taking a shot of penicillin <laughs> like I was in the second grade. The ban on coughing left some wondering, sniffing okay though? <laughs> Trump has a tendency to order things out. Hey, get this thing out of here, will you? From teleprompters to crying babies. You can get the baby out of here. But at least he's no Caligula. What is it? When a young man's coughing irritated him, off with his head. I've cured his cough. Will President Trump keep his head the next time someone coughs? Genie Mo, CNN. Take it away. It looks horrible. New York.